Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Pasty Shift Scan. It is good to see you. It's good to have you back here. Thank you for coming back. Shenmue Tree Trailer Teaser Thingy just dropped online on the PlayStation Video channel, and I have not watched this yet. Uh, if you did not know, Shenmue is a game that goes back to the Dreamcast era, probably, uh, well, was it three, three, four generations back of consoles? Three generations. Three generations back. Yes. Three generations back of consoles to this, the last console that Sega created themselves called the Dreamcast. There was Shenmue 1 and Shenmue 2, which then was uh, remastered, well, remastered, uh, tried to port it across to the original Xbox, and we got to see the Shenmue 2 from there, and hopefully there was expectation that there possibly would be Shenmue 3 in the future, and that was a long ass time ago. Uh, there was a Kickstarter for this game, people backed it, there was a lot of questions about what was going on, because they are asking for Kickstarter money, but still getting a publisher, and then getting a lot of money from Sony, and getting a lot of money from other people, but here it is! The first teaser is here! I am curious to find out what they've done with Shenmue 3, I hope it's something good, because this could go horribly wrong, so let's take a quick look. <laughs> oh. Come on, Sega! Well, not Sega. Be Weissnet, isn't it? So yeah, original game, copyright Sega, uh, copyright Ynet. Looks pretty though. Uh, well, the backdrop looks pretty. Ooh. Right, I said the background looks pretty, but um... It's very static and stiff looking character models. Ooh. Oh, it does look different in that cutscene there. So, rendered parts look... Obviously, the, it, it, right, so this is a teaser, so this must be like alpha early stuff, but... I mean, this game's been in development for a long-ass time. Finally, they have been building it recently, but... Um... Obviously, this, this, does, this has a, the, pro, the same feel as any teaser trailer for the Shenmue series that we've seen over the years. Where it shows him training with somebody, him fighting with somebody, collectible items, these plates and pots and stuff. A little bit of plot development, the interesting girls he'll meet along the way, and will wander through these city streets that you're going to be lapping over and over again while walking around. I'm looking for a Chinese man named Landy. From Shenmue 3. Mm. From Weissnet. And Deep S oh, and Deep Silver, okay. So, coming to PS4, running on the Unreal Engine, Weissnet with Deep Silver. Okay, this is this is interesting. So that's that's. Uh, well, I was gonna try and get that logo. There we go. All right, that is better to actually have in the background. So, shit, oh, are you serious? There we go. <laughs> is this the fact that I actually try and get these logos to actually pop up in the background for it to be convenient for me? There we go. That's better. I'll put this down gently. So Shenmue 3. Um, obviously, the, there's a lot of expectation on this game to be good, but that doesn't look very impressive to me, guys. Um, it, 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 hopefully, they actually will nail it on the mechanics and uh, the really good story to continue it on. But Shenmue 3 has been gone for a long, long time. The world mechanics and gameplay have changed so, so much since they were previous. Since it was originally around. Um, the setting and the location doesn't even... Let, well, well, that's the thing. It's, it, can't, it can't do the retro games anymore because that was one of the fun things about uh, the older Shenmue is that you could play Super Hang-On, you could play Space Hire, you could play old Sega games, you could play Afterburner, you could play old Sega games in the arcades and stuff when everyone around the towns and city and have an arcade and a machine at home. But this, you can't do that. They like there's no games from the like you don't have the license, they don't have the, the connection to Sega anymore. So what do you do but otherwise? What other games do you do? Is it all gonna be Pachinko in the streets or so on? Uh gacha, making sure to get all the capsule toys. But um even then this the location doesn't seem to like, lend itself towards it. Uh, quite as much, I imagine. But um I, I still need to catch up on what the plot of the end of Shen Shenmue 2 was. I think I played the first couple of hours of Shenmue 2 back in the day. I actually owned I owned both on one and two on Dreamcast, but I don't. I've never finished two. Um, maybe, maybe it's time to actually take a look at an older game. Let's take a look at the Shenmue. Maybe here on the channel, if you guys be interested in that, then make sure to say in the comments below. Um, I would happily play through at least the second one. I'm not too sure about the first one anymore. I don't know if I really want to go back to forklift driving as much as I used to. Um, but yeah, we could play. We could play. That'd be a good crack. That'd be a bit of fun. So um, 
Yeah, Shenmue 3. Obviously a Kickstarter, uh, Kickstarter ran game that actually has had so, a lot of problems in its history and time being made, but hopefully we can see it fairly soon, considering the fact we've got this trailer for the um, version on PS4 that will hopefully be coming in not that long from now, and uh, Shenmue 3 will finally be in our grubby waiting hands. So guys, thank you very much. If you actually enjoyed watching this trailer, my reactions to it, any thoughts that I actually had about it, then make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you don't particularly care to subscribe, make sure to memorize the name past each of skin. Always do that. And of course, if you actually feel like it, uh, check out some of the other videos. Because in fact, if you're watching on YouTube, boom, there'll be a subscribe button up there. There'll be a box up here with playlists of all the things I've actually looked at on quick reviews. Over in the far corner will be recent episodes. And over in the far right will be an episode just for you, based on the stuff that you look at on YouTube. So I recommend that one. That's the one that you should probably check out first if you're going to check out any of the videos. So uh, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see all you guys in the next trailer. Bye.